In this video, I decided to go and chill at the Belize Defense Forces Day. But I ended up learning lessons from this wonderful friend of mine. Just teaching my kids having their own business. And from this slippery pole challenge. My name is Miki. Keep watching. Hello everyone, this is Mickey. Welcome to my channel where I draw lessons from life experience and I also share my experience of the place that I am working, which at the moment is Belize in Central America. So if you're new on this channel and you enjoy experiencing new things whilst learning lessons, then I will please ask you to subscribe and come on my journey with me. Thank you very much. Let's get into the video. The Belize Defense Forces, the BDF, was formed on the 1st January 1978 after the disbandment of the Belize Volunteer Guard and the Police Special Forces. So around January and February, this occasion, the BDF Day, is organized to commemorate this formation of the BDF. During this occasion, the Belizean public is allowed on prize barrack, the main BDF camp, to enjoy various activities. One of the activities that caught my eye was this slippery pole challenge, where a pole is smeared with grease with a treasure at the top. And how competitors get the treasure from the top? Well, you can look for yourself. But watching this challenge got me thinking about something. It got me thinking about jumping into the unknown. There are a lot of ventures that you would like to undertake, but you are scared because no one around you or no one in your family has ever tried it. But I want to tell you that just like this greasy pole, you pave a way for the next generation behind you if you dare to try. Every unsuccessful attempt on this pole makes it less slippery for the next attempt. They tried and they failed. Tried and they failed and people laughed. But they got further after every fail, paving the way for the next group of people to try. It went on for so long that I decided to take a break and soak in the fun. Yes, 
And then I met this wonderful friend of mine. But I want to ask him why he does it. Why does he always like, I know he does some office job, right? But he's always out there on his bike selling. Once he actually was cycling so fast to go and sell that, his chain came off. I don't know if he remembers that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't remember so that. So I want to ask you, so why do you do it? Why do you always want to sell? Uh, it's just a passion, you know, and just teaching my kids having their own business and not following whatsoever somebody's somebody else is telling them from their business yeah. you know, always try to have your own doing that is it makes you a better person yeah because it teaches you the moral in life yeah teach you how to manage your, your, your lifestyle itself so it's good there's one thing I don't know I don't know much about you but do you think youth nowadays want the shortcut so sometimes they want to like date some sugar daddy or they want to you know use what they have to get what they want, if you get what I mean. What is your stance on that? Honestly, there's a lot of young females that love that lifestyle, you know, and that's one thing that I, that I try to teach my kids, you know. Don't go for that lifestyle. Yeah. Try to go for much higher, and you will definitely excel in life. Yeah. You know what, I'm going to leave you so that you do your business. Yeah, no Thank problem. you very much for giving me this opportunity. Yeah. Thank you too. All right. Eventually, persistence won them the prize. Well, enough of the lessons. Let's get into the fun. <laughs>
there you have it guys a day at the belize defense forces day i hope this video was fun and it was informative please like and subscribe if you are new to this channel to come on my journey as i said earlier thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video